Hi everyone, it's Olivia from Girly Brunches. I'm just going to do a slightly different video today. Um, I just wanted to do a little review on some different style of crochet hooks that I've um, recently been trying. I've had these for a couple of weeks now and um, you may have seen them online but they're called the um, Addy Swing Crochet Hook. Um, they're German and I have actually found them to be quite comfortable to use and I wanted to do a video on them because there are two ways of holding a crochet hook and you know maybe you've looked at them before like I have done and thought maybe you didn't want to try them because it might not suit the way that you hold a crochet hook. I just put them back in the boxes so that you could see how they um, they came to you but um, this one is a three and a half mil and as you can see the handle is pretty similar to toothbrushes and it has these nice grips here and here. Now there are a couple of ways that people hold a crochet hook and they will suit anyone that holds a crochet hook like this, like a pen, and they'll also suit people who hold a crochet hook like this. As you can see it fits nicely in the hand. They will also be nice for people who are left handed because it's either it goes either way. I'm not left handed so <laughs> as you can see but it would seem that after using these I've discovered that I seem to hold a crochet hook in a completely different way altogether. I seem to hold it like this and I work like that. So what I'm trying to say is if however you hold a crochet hook it doesn't seem to be too bad and yes it's a little bit different to um, what I'm used to because that's what I'm used to using, that's the equivalent. And I've noticed that since using these, I do seem to like to work further down the hook than obviously they think that you should, because it stops here. And I found that a little bit frustrating to get used to, to begin with, but I have to say that I've made a couple of blankets using the um, number four, which is this one. And I didn't have as much hand strain after using this style of crochet hook than I would normally do. I mean, I don't have any problems with my hands, but I appreciate that <laughs> we're not getting younger and there will be a time when my hands will start to hurt. Um, my mum doesn't crochet anymore because of that fact. And, um, well, I just thought maybe if I was using a proper handled crochet hook it might mean that um, I get to crochet for a bit longer so you know that would be ideal for me because I do want to keep crocheting um, so yeah I've bought just a few sizes I bought the sizes that I normally tend to use so these two would be definitely the size that I use the most number four and number two that's because of the types of yarns that I use and I have to admit when I first saw this I thought that was much bigger than my normal four mil um, hook so me being me I got the tape measure out and measured it and yeah that is exactly four mil <laughs> yeah I, I such doubting Thomas eh but yes they are exactly the same and I you know yes I hold my crochet hook like this some people hold their crochet hook like this which I'm guessing which is probably how they'd imagine that you would hold it just because of the way it is shaped as you can see but, like I say, if you do crochet holding a, a hook like this, I don't think you would have problems holding it either. It's very comfortable on this grip. You know, I don't know if you can tell, but it is nice. It's nice. It's not soft, it's not like squishy or anything, but it is definitely more comfortable to hold than, um, than this. And now I still find this useful. And from the purposes of my videos, I will definitely still be using these because um, you get to see better what I'm doing because this kind of I think it covers it up what I'm doing so I will continue to use these and I will always use these but if I have a big project to do I will definitely consider using one of these um, Addy swing crochet hooks for the majority of the work so yeah I just thought I would show you those because I have looked at these quite a few times and another point actually I should raise here that they are quite expensive these were well, I got these on eBay and 
the cheapest ones I found. I mean, that was just me. What I found, you might find cheaper, but these were six pound fifty each. So yeah, definitely a considered purchase. Um, when you consider that I got a whole set of crochet hooks like these, I think I got two mil, two and nine mil. I think for eight pounds, eight between eight and twelve pounds. I can't remember exactly, but. Yeah, you can see that I've spent more on these four crochet hooks here than I did on a whole set. So, you know, only go for the sizes that you probably use the most, like I did. Um, like these two sizes, and then I just got these because I do tend to use these occasionally. But definitely these two sizes are the ones that I use. The most disappointed that the ones that I really like to use aren't, aren't in pink. But hey, yeah, <laughs> that's just me. So, um, <laughs> yeah. So I got those two. Give them a go, see what you think. Um, but if you're happy with just using these, then that's you know fine. I, I can see that you do get um, people you sell handles to go on crochet hooks, and um, I did try those before, and I never really got on with them. But um, I kind of decided that I would try these, and I have to say I quite like them. But um, yeah, so that's my little review of an Addy Swing crochet hook. And um, let me know how you get on with them, if you try them or if you use them anyway. Okay, I'll be back soon with a crochet video. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.